What's up, what's up guys, your boy Silencio. Welcome to another video for a Bleach Thousand Year Blood War. Um, this is going to be the second episode review, so we're going to have my live reaction. I have not seen this, I have not done anything, and then in the end, uh, we'll speak about it. So the second one is going to be called Foundation Stones. And I see Kisuke, so we're going to finally see Kisuke here, right? He's like one of my favorites. He's like my basically my top three in the Bleach universe. I but yeah, uh, I'll say that. His case is definitely one of my favorites. So, let's go see it. Yerp. Let's go. Yo, yo. Ah, uh, this one he cut off his arm. Damn. Whoa. This guy's a badass. <laughs> Woo! Hey, wait, this is the first time we hear the, the intro, right? We didn't hear the intro in the first video. Am I crazy? Copyright music. Yeah. I've always say this in uh intros, they always spoil for you what's to come in the season and the bad guys and everybody's gonna show up, it's like crazy, but it is what it is. I, I like that pink. I'm not gonna lie to you, that pink really stands out a little bit. It's like different contrast to it. Ooh, we end up with Orihima in the window. Chad chilling right here. Oh, this is glooming. And we start. People are still glooming. Oh, because of what happened, you think? Mm. I have no attention. <laughs> he said he had no attention helping him out. What? Oh, shit. I just noticed the translating shit is so small. Wait, in Squad 1, um, Toy Fon? Died? What? Bro, what? I think I I just somebody spoiled it for me a while ago. Told him that he dies in the in the arc. Forgot about that. I think I think I remember now. Oh, that's why it was blue. <laughs> Get it now. <laughs> this is what I don't understand. Why Nail came out of nowhere? Was was she stuck at Aaron and the uh, Hueco Mundo? That's, that's what I don't get. He's gonna let him bleed out, dude. A prophet. I think he's gonna end up killing him. <laughs> I fucking said it, dude. Damn. よろしかったのですか何がだアランカルの兵士はセンキューの戦力なのではソウルソサイティ振興のためにシズレの一つに過ぎぬえ、ウェコムンドがやられたってなんだよ。This is one more missing? Damn, everybody's there now. Oh. Damn. Rest in peace. Yeah, I'm gonna be pissed. Damn, Baragon and Stark is dead? Bro, what? How about you, Kiora and Grimjo? Oh, uh, there's the other guy at. There's Halibel. Damn, this guy's a beast, man. Shit. So they're taking um, not only Halibel, they're taking somebody else. Yerp. Oh, I guess he's not going. You know about we're we managed. <laughs> Ooh, my favorite character. Did I run to church with Komundo? I forgot he did that last time. Right. Oh, Is he still banned from um society? I don't remember. Garganta. Where's this bueno? 
Just as a bueno mundo. Right. No, he's not. She's not a scout? Wow. I didn't know she had that power like that. Oh, and if I see other uh, Aaron cards, like the main ones, because the mission three, Stark and um, Thing is dead, and uh, Boris, and Halibut was taken, so. Opie. Wait, 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 who are these? We'll be having a selection competition. What? They have a couple of, Oh, I guess who's strongest to get recruited? I guess. I want to see who they are. Ah, well, he did, he did say it. Yep, he finally found somebody that is able to do it. I think I remember the one on the right. I don't think in the left one I remember. Hmm. What the fuck? Uh, ah, the other ones. Where were you guys? We were away. Cocker just because of defeated. Uh, they, they mentioned Aizen. That's the first time they mentioned Aizen, too. Sheesh. Damn, she could talk. She hits. They're strong, but can they fight him? Yeah, he seems to be. I mean, he's there for a reason. Disappointing. Wonder Edge. Oh, そう、このゾクンの所有者、現世で捕虜が大量に消滅したことで、コンパクトのバランスが大きく崩れた。これは現世の。あ、ソイフォンイズ。エクスティングシュゴーゾウ。ボウ。クイーンシーだ。ヒ
worried. But bro, I don't think he did anything. I think it's just the pressure. His power, his uh, spiritual pressure ended up doing something because he didn't even fucking even do any, not even a sign. I don't know, man. This guy is insane. And Udui is staying behind because, you know, he's not his duty. I wonder what's his part in this whole arc because um, the enemies are Quincy's. And I think Udui's dad is still alive, right? So I wonder how his dad going to be. If this Quincy is a revolutionary, like, like, no, I'm pretty sure not all Quincy's are like, all like this, right? It's just a, a, a different part of the Quincy's that are doing this revolution about they want peace, blah, blah, blah. Out of nowhere. And also, I'm telling you this. Also, I didn't know the Captain Lieutenant died. It was spoiled to me. I think it was last year. The arc that he ended up dying. Because I always said that he was the weakest one. Like, he always seemed in an anime. He always always the one that been, like, fooled, taken down so easily. And he's supposed to be the lieutenant for the captain. Like, come on, man. You know, you're the, you are the captain of captains and you just get... Destroy like that. And they told me that. Supposedly in this arc, he's strong. But he died. I don't fucking know. It's just it's just insane to me. We just have to wait and see what, what else we get. Uh, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what's next. Because like I said before. I feel like the fight is going to start in Hueco Mundo. It's probably going to end in Soul Society. Because of the captains. I wonder if the captain's going to end up going to Hueco Mundo. Do we even know what's going on in Hueco Mundo, the captains? I don't know. I don't think, I don't think they know. Because they, they would have just talked about it, right? Oh, Mayu would have noticed or whatever. They know the Quincy, but I didn't even... Where is he at? Is he, is he is the bad guy in Hueco? Or he's in his own fucking planet, universe, whatever the fuck he is. Ah, this is just a headache. Not knowing these stuff. That's why I know how why people would read the manga. Because you could catch up and, know, and understand the thing. But I'd rather see visual than read. It's always been the thing for me. That um, if there's like... A, the comic book, I better just wait for something to come out for me to see like an animated or cartoon, whatever it is, so I could see what's going on rather than just reading it. It was been like this since I was little. That's why I never I never read the manga or read comic books or read books itself. It is what it is. Probably cursed that way. Hey. Whatever. But yeah, guys, that's just my thought, man. I'm, I'm excited. Um I'm gonna try to make these videos a little bit longer when it comes to the live reaction and shorter to my explanation. You guys can see more because you guys said it, I was cutting it too much, but Gotta understand, I'm not trying to get striked because this is actually like on Hulu, Disney, whatever, you know, and it's a big company. I don't want to get striked for it. And music and sounds and all that could get triggered by copyright quick. So I'm trying to my best to see what I could do and can still give you a clean um, experience at the same time. So bear with me. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, man. Let me know down below what you guys think. As always, I'll see you guys. Fake star with the wife.